Hi, it's Maggie. This is a speed build that I did in Oasis Springs, so it's for one of my save files. Um, this is just a tiny home. It's literally like a tiny home, as you can see. It's, it's it's a little bit, it's like 59 by 64 tiles, I think that's how big it is, um, but it's a very small home, so it's only for one sim, or it could be for two sims, because I did give a double bed, but I didn't really make much space for like a living room or a kitchen, I, I mean, I did make a lot of space for the kitchen, but I didn't make much space for a living room, which was my fault, but like, my bad, like, I, I should have made more space for the living room, but I just wasn't really th thinking about it too much. A lot of times when I go into bells, I just think about the kitchen, making the kitchen big. I don't know why that. I don't know why that is. But anyway, um, yeah, as you can see, this build is coming together. It's pretty quickly. Um, I forgot to record the very first part of it where I was doing the shell because I didn't steal anyone else's shell. I promise, I didn't. Um, but like, I was just doing the shell, and and the shell was really quick. So I guess it's there's no point of having it in the video anyway. But I mean, there's also it should also also been in the video, but. Anyway, um, that was a mistake on my part. I wasn't recording. I recorded too late. But yeah. Um, anyway, so this is me just doing the landscaping. I had a lot of landscaping, so I decided to call this build Overgrown, overgrown Tiny Home. Whether it is an over, overgrown tiny home or not. I don't know if it is or not. But like, um, basically it's just like kind of overgrown and with like debug plants and stuff like that. I don't know if any, everyone would consider it overgrown, but I just thought that was like a fit, a fitting title for the build. Um, yeah, so <laughs> I did some pretty cool things with this build, like with the wallpapers, and I usually like kind of I'm lacking when I do wallpapers because I'm not like, how do I say, it? I'm not that good at wallpapers, finding the right wallpapers, so I was lacking, I'm always lacking a bit, but I think I did pretty good on this build. And obviously, as you can see here, I did make the build, the bathroom a little bit smaller. I made the bathroom really big at first, and I was like, no, that's just, that doesn't make any sense. And so I'm glad I made it smaller, but yeah, and I was having some trouble there with the roof, like the roof glitching, I didn't even know what it was, but yeah. It was, a, it was a floor tile. <laughs> I gotta play closer. I gotta pay closer attention to that next time when I'm building. But who, who I mean, we all make mistakes, so yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's not that big of a deal, anyway. But um, yeah. So yeah, here's I'm here. I'm going to the debug menu. Sorry for the awkward silence. I'm just saying I'm going to the debug menu. And um, I added in this little pond in the back here. <laughs> I really like the pond. I think it's such a nice touch to build. Even though this build is like tiny and the lot is tiny, I think I, I was so proud of myself for adding in that pond. I just think it's like, such a nice touch to add it to Willow Creek home. But yeah, <laughs> I never really delve into like using those items, like those, um, those what are they called? Show live edit object items. I never really use them. But I took the liberty to to use them today, and I like them a lot. <laughs> I do. I really like them, and I think I should use them more often because I don't use them enough. I really don't. I see other builders use them enough, like a lot, like not enough, a lot, a lot, and like <laughs> sorry, I'm stuttering a little bit. Anyways, um, I see them use them, them them in their builds a lot, and I don't just I just forget about it, or I just don't have like I have a cheat, cheat shortener mod thing. I don't know how else to say it, cheat shortener, mod, something, I don't know what the mod is exactly called, but um, it helps me with like doing the cheats in like a couple of letters, so I can just type in a couple of letters and then it's like the cheat is like activated, but it doesn't have that for show live but an object, so I get lazy, so I don't want to include it, but I'm really glad I did in this build, I think this build is so pretty and I think it all came together super nicely, especially the exterior. I'm not that good at small home interiors, although I feel like I'm not. I struggle a bit with the space. Like obviously, I made this kitchen, in this in this room, in this room, in this house. Like not room, in this house. I made the kitchen super big, but um, yeah, that's just kind of how it went. <laughs> that's just kind of how I went with building, and I just kind of made the kitchen super big. Maybe I'll play, pay closer attention next time to making the the rooms more proportionally sized. But yeah. <laughs> Anyway, so I don't think there's much else to say about this build. I already said, you know, pretty much all the exterior, what I did about the exterior. The interior, you kind of get an idea, and the interior goes by super, really super fast. 
so as you can see there's only like three minutes left in the video and the interior just the rest of those three minutes so maybe i could have spent more time on it but i didn't exactly have a lot of time because i was going to bed soon and i don't i have to go to bed early some days like sunday night and monday night i have to go to bed early because i go to my program monday tuesday and um this program that i go to it's like a day program it's kind of like a summer camp but not a summer camp it's like just a program to help me um, I don't really want to dwell into it too much, but yeah, you, you got the idea. But um, I have to go to bed early and wake up at like 7 a.m. or something, Monday, Tuesday. It's only Monday, Tuesday, so that's, I'm thankful for that, but yeah. But by the time this video is going out, to be honest, it's probably I'm probably all done with the program for the summer. I'm probably all done with it, because I know the program gets out August, I think it's August no, yeah, I think it's August 7th that it gets out, or August 3rd or August 4th. It's that week of the 3rd, 4th, 7th, whatever it is. I don't know. I can't keep track of numbers. So it's that week, and yeah, so I'm really excited for that. And this is when that video is going out, so I'll be more, even more happy. Like, I don't even know. You know, you know what I mean, but yeah. Um, yeah, I don't think there's much else to say about the interior. I don't really have a lot to say about my interiors. I don't really customize them too much. I feel like I'm kind of lacking it. But I do like the way the interior came out. I think it's very cute. But I would just change the kitchen size and give it a bigger living room. Because there really is no living room in this build. <laughs> I just realized that. But anyways, I hope you guys like the build. Because I worked really hard on it. Especially the exterior. I worked so hard on the exterior. I think it looks gorgeous. One of my best tiny homes. I, I must say. <laughs> so, yeah. I hope you guys like it. Um, leave any comments, suggestions. I know I usually never say that suggestions. But you can leave some suggestions for builds or cast videos. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.